Skinny peeps, my name is Scroops, and welcome back to my bi monthly upload of Project Arrhythmia. Yeah, my schedule has fallen apart if it even existed in the first place, but that doesn't matter because I'm here now. But today we're back, and this time we're also featuring Jeremy. Once again, it's been many moons, my friend, but I decided I wanted you to join me for this session because it has been a while and I might need the support. But for the different levels that I have in mind for this session, most of them are actually sort of me playing catch up in a way. It's basically me trying to catch up on the different levels that have made it to the most popular of all time list and that I really want to play. But there's always just been something else uh, incredibly new in the way that I've been wanting to play, but we'll get to cover it this time. And the very first that I wanted to play is... No, that's not it. And it's not it. And yes, the creator of this game has reached out to me several times and told me that there's a search feature that allows me to find the levels very easily, but why would I do what the developer wants me to do? <laughs> because see here, I, it's right here. I can find this stuff all on my own. I don't need your search function. But this time we're going to be playing Nebula, a level that I think is based on a character I've already seen before. That thumbnail at least looks familiar. Eternal Nightmares 3. You and Drea were leaving the prison, but something started attacking both of you due to confusion and deep fog. You ended up lost. Thanks to Sherbet for the amazing thumbnail, I'm presuming. Now, I'm not familiar with Terra XP, at least as a name, but I have terrible memories, so I may be wrong about that. But also, Eternal Nightmares 3 doesn't say me much, but I recognize that character design. It is only a moderate level though, so I should be able to pass this with fly- Oh, well that's dark. Oh wow, okay, hi. Hello. Wait, are you- Oh yeah, no, you're dead. I was about to say maybe your character, but no, you're straight up dead. Okay. Ooh. Hi. Oh, never mind. You look different from the one I was thinking you were. Oh, what? Oh, God. Okay. I need to get used to how smooth Project Rhythmia levels have become. Like, 60 FPS now is actually like a normalcy. It's not just something that's like a cool achievement. It's something everyone can make. It's cool. Okay, okay. I got it. I got it. Stakes through the heart. Shot to the heart. You're to blame. Hey, Bill Cipher, I recognize that eyeball anywhere. Oh, but this is a long one. Even if it isn't normal, I might not be able to get through this without dying completely. Oh, hi. Oh, you're cool. Oh, oh, do I need to? Oh, God, what, what? You let us die? Why? I don't know, did I? I dashed directly into the enemy. You couldn't tell I've been playing this game for two years if you were looking at me. Oh, it's yelling at them, maybe? I'm unsure? I think so? Okay, maybe it's not yelling at me. Maybe I'm not the bad person here. Oh, but this is so pretty looking. You know, I got like... Yeah, uh, you know it's cheating to make like something very nice and purpley. Ooh. Nice M1 Garant. What? What am I looking at? What? It looks like a- now that I have saw that, it sort of looks like you're wearing like a World War One German helmet or something. I don't know the story. I wish I did and I sort of regret that I didn't play the original levels now. Okay, it is still only a mo moderate. It's scary, but it's only a moderate. It's only a moderate, so just appreciate the aesthetic. I don't need to stress out too much about this one. Oh, but it's so pretty. The bloom effects. I hope YouTube renders all this, actually. I'm unsure if you're my enemy or if we're together in this, because you look very sad. Okay. Okay, I got it. It's fine. Ooh. Hello. Uh, hi. What are you? Are you Square Bill Cipher? Cube Cipher, maybe? Or, I don't know, I'm assuming another character entirely, and I'm not right about my guess at all. Oh, God. Oh... This is a cool visual. Hello! It's me, how are you doing? What's going on, are you just gonna sit here and linger? Oh! To be continued? What? Is that the ending? No! Special thanks Sherbert, the DXL44, Mr. Neon Umbra, that one guy, Noodlekin. God! Okay, okay, yeah, okay, I think that was just the Discord message and I didn't miss anyone. Thanks for playing. Who are you? I don't know, wonderful. Now on to the next one. You're absolutely correct, but let me compliment a level first, Jesus. That was incredibly pretty. 
and I feel really bad about the fact that I am so terrible at keeping up with any of the collections for Project Arrhythmia because I don't get the story context. I just play each of them individually for the spectacle and I bet even if I played like the collections, I would forget immediately. My brain is... oh. You'd really think it would be like some advanced Lego technique going on in here, but no, I promise you, it's all Duplo. But still really cool and a really well-made level for someone who I'm unfamiliar with, Terra XP. I don't recognize the name immediately, but if I've played a level by them, please tell me what it is down in the comments and then hopefully I'll be able to remember it. But now on to the next one, and this one is going to be harder, but it has also reached I believe the very second spot on most popular, which that is an incredible feat. Like the the eighth and ninth place, those switch out all the time, but the second place, that, that one's hard to claim. But yeah, it's this one, World is Mine by Geoxor. I don't even know if I've heard this Geoxor song before. Created by Noodlekin, a very familiar name on this channel. Three years later, and Lumi is back for round three. Thanks to Chero Dust for the thumbnail and credit to Lumbot84 for Lumi's existence and letting me make the level. That's correct! Of all the characters I actually know the lore about, Lumi is one of them. And yes, I remember Lumbot created Lumi and then Lumi has already been allowed to uh, be uh, used in other levels. And I don't know, there's been some really freaking cool stuff with her. And I think it's like one of the very first levels I ever played. I might be wrong about that, but it's at least very, very early, like like in the episode count. So I'm just excited for this one. Three years later, like a recelebration. Okay, I hope this lives up to my expectations. Oh yeah. What's this, the Ur tree? The Elden Ring tree? That's not right. But I do recall there's like Yggdrasil, I think it was a level. Oh, hi. Oh, hi, okay. Okay, oh god, no, it's Vocaloid. My biggest nemesis. It's okay, we'll work, we'll work through it. At least this is a very zoomed in map. Oh, it, that's rare these days. Usually you have like way too much space to work with and you have to dash inches with like a full dash. Okay, oh god, oh god, I got it. I got it, I got it, I got it. Why am I getting close to me vibes from this? Oh, hi. Lumi, you got a haircut, I think? I can't look at you. Oh, no. Oh, that's cool, though. I don't know why you suddenly have angelic, Bible-esque superpowers, but I'm for it. I'm for it. Girl power and all that. Okay, 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 okay. Close to the middle. Stay close to the middle. Stay center. The square and center. Don't move. Oh, I don't think I can touch those. Okay, 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 okay. Hi. Thanks for popping by, I guess. Oh, oh god. Oh, no, 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 no. I panic dash and then I just dash into something else because I'd rather take damage on purpose than not. Oh, wow. I'm running down the corner so I can take a thumbnail picture. That's cool. Oh, man. It's been so- it's become so easy to make thumbnails for this game because, like, the art that people make for this is just so pretty. Considering it's all like squares and shapes you're working with. Spell card. Simi. No, wait, wait, wait. I didn't get to read that. Oh, I didn't get to read that. Oh, no. Oh, but I do like Joxor. I do like the music. The music is good. I want to hear that drop again. Oh, wait. You actually sent me back before the drop? Really? Oh, yeah. This is a long stretch. Okay, okay. I'll try. Spell card. Semi circular. Another dimension. Could not read the other stuff if I tried. Okay. Oh, oh. Oh, I got it. 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 I got it. I got it. I got it. I can do this. Just focus. I hate that I have to talk at the same time, but I do. Okay. Whoa! That's so cool! Oh, it's like... This is like the initial, like, what's it? The original level. You guys know which one I'm talking about. The original level with where the square was like there with the speakers. You know the one. Oh, but it's like so mo much more well made. DIY Damien background and end screen. Chetto does thumbnail. Tignato hard mode design. Noodlekin level and animation. Oh, Lumbot 84 character and level recording. Is that it? No, that was so cool, but so short. Oh, and like, okay, world is mine. Oh, looks like the font for like a Minecraft texture pack. I don't know why that specifically, why that freaking ancient memory jumped to mind, but it did. Oh man, that made like my, I don't know. I, f <laughs> I feel like, I, f 
I, I feel like I'm getting a hit of a little bit of that feeling that like a grandma gets when she realizes like in that moment that she's had kids who themselves have had kids and watched both of them just grow up. It's very weird and probably more of a sensation than most people get from playing Project Arrhythmia of all things. But I don't know man, I've just been following this game for so long and it's gotten so pretty to look at. I mean back then there was like the very very rare creator who after putting months into work could make a level that looked very pretty but basically broke your computer in half if you tried to play it. And the way that people recorded it was actually by playing it on half speed and then just speeding it up in post. I think at least that's how it worked but it was I don't know it was just so so much trouble back then and my god it, it, you, you don't have to go far to find a pretty level anymore and it's so cool. And I really hope that this game keeps like, I don't know, that the community keeps staying as creative um, as as they, they as they are right now. But anyways, peeps, that is all the time I have for this quite short Project Arrhythmia video. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope you all loved the levels as much as I did. And I hope that you guys will keep rallying behind the Project Arrhythmia community so we can see more awesome stuff like this in the future. But anyways, genuinely thank you all so much for watching and I catch you all in the next one. Peace.